Um, so my time in Saratoga, it's been a really great time. I've enjoyed myself, meeting the people. Um, and the town itself reminds me of Red Bank, New Jersey. So that quaint, just small town feel. Uh, a lot of great stores. I, to me, it looks like a big restaurant city. Enjoyed my time here. Uh, great turnout, great people. Um, I got to see some people that I know as well. Um, and just being with my castmates, that, you know, I always enjoy doing that. For me, um, it's like the way that I put it, I mean, not that it, this was really the cause, but it's like, I got a divorce and then I was just kind of looking for something for me. Um, I, you know, kind of trying to find yourself or uh, just trying to find something to take your mind off of things. And, and But since I was young, I was always drawn to the arts in some way whether it was drawing, um, interested in photography, not that I really did it, but it's just, there was just something about being creative. And I enjoyed watching movies, especially the musicals. Um, but I didn't know that I can do anything related in the field of arts in any way or creativity. I was brought up to know that you kind of had to get a job support the family and all that kind of stuff but you know once I got older and I and uh, kind of was on my own truly on my own ind independent then that's when it, 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 I have to say that it found me I was doing community theater at the time um, in Atlantic Highlands Red Bank um, just several of the of the, the area in South Jersey while I was in rehearsals for a show I found out that someone was holding auditions at the First Avenue Playhouse where he held auditions and I had worked at. And so I went there, did a monologue, and I'm told that the guys pretty much fell in love with my audition piece and he called me. I, I can't remember what kind of time span it was that he called me up, but he invited me to come down to the community store to meet him and then to take the script, read it, make sure that I was comfortable with basically, you know, the whole 37 and all that kind of stuff, so. <laughs> and I, I, I fell in love with the script, so. It's always nice to meet the fans. Finding out how the movie inspired them, how we as actors have inspired them to be able to go and pursue what it is that they want to pursue and have always thought of but didn't think that they could do it, so. And, and if there's any way that I can give them pointers, I always try to do that. Hopefully it doesn't come across as, you know, being kind of know-it-all or anything like that, but I can only give them what I've experienced. Well, hopefully, you know, that helps them, but I've always enjoyed meeting the fans. And then, even if they don't come to purchase anything, I just, I like that they come by to say hello. I like people watching and seeing all the costumes, amazing costumes that sometimes some of these people have and they, they've created themselves. So would you come back to Saratoga Comic Con in the city of Saratoga? In a heartbeat! <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Um, I, you know, I think upstate New York as a whole is just beautiful up here. Um, anytime that I've come up, it's been beautiful, it's nice and green and just quiet and there's a charm about it. So I want to thank everybody who came out to Saratoga Comic Con. Hopefully I'll see you at another one. And you know, anytime you ever see any of us anywhere, just say hello. Love you all. Thank you. Bye-bye.